currently sitting on the toilet because I got really stressed packing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I ran into my safe space. <laughs> One sec. Wait here. Hi. <sighs> All right, so it's like 12.30 a.m. I don't know what kind of video this is gonna be. I leave my house in four hours to go to the airport and then I fly to Dallas and then I fly out of Dallas straight to Korea at 11 a.m. And it's gonna be a 14 and a half hour flight. <laughs> In 11 hours, I will be in the air flying to Korea. <laughs> I can't believe it's actually happening. Pretty much, I really wanted to make a bunch of videos about this. Let me try and collect my thoughts. It didn't work. I wanted to make a video where I was like packing, a video on the plane, a video of my first day there, you know? But let's just say it's 12.30 the night before and I still am not completely packed. <laughs> yes, you heard that correctly. <laughs> So needless to say, I was freaking out while I was packing earlier today. Like I've just been running around all day trying to get stuff figured out. This is the state of my room right now. So those are my two suitcases. That's my carry-on and that's my backpack. And that's like other stuff. And then I haven't packed like any of my toiletries or anything. So I just have a lot to do when I wake up at 4 a.m. <laughs> But yeah, I was not going to be able to like relax enough to <laughs> set up all my film stuff and film a video about me packing. All this to say, I think I'm just going to do one vlog like style video for this whole like next couple days of my life and then just give you one bigger video instead of a few shorter videos because that will just make it a lot easier for me. <laughs> I'm really sleepy right now and I'm just thinking about how this time tomorrow I'll be about to land. <laughs> Oh, that's so crazy. I'm so excited. I'm feeling this weird mix of emotions. I'm like, I'm excited. I'm not really scared. I just am like anticipating it. I think I'm just really eager. And so that's making me like have butterflies and stuff. I don't know. I don't know what I'm feeling. I can't explain it, but I'm feeling lots of things. <laughs> Last night my family and I went to dinner and then I got some breakfast with some friends today. Last weekend I had like a going away party. So I feel like closure for Oklahoma. I also feel like I'm being really calm right now, but it's like almost 1 a.m. and I've been really stressed all day. And I'm about to move to another country in literally hours. So forgive me for not being super energetic right now. I guess I could show you what I'm packing. A lot of clothes and shoes. <laughs> Never mind. I just decided that would be really boring. <laughs> okay, I guess I, I'm gonna go to sleep now. Next time I see you, I'll be looking busted in the in the in the a.m. <laughs> So after that, I didn't really record that much because of some drama that ensued at the airport. So let me fill you the frickin'. I almost drop kicked somebody in the airport. So basically we got there and we we're like, oh, mm -hmm, let's go check in and stuff so we can like sit down for a little before my flight leaves. Cause we were like, I don't know, like an hour or so early. It's an Oklahoma airport, you know, like it was not busy. So I go up to the little kiosk, the little touchscreen kiosk to check my bags in and stuff. The very last screen is like, how many bags are you taking? I was like two and I click next and it goes, the bag check-in for your flight has closed. The two options that I could choose from were book a new flight or continue without bags. Both options I was not okay with. So my mom being the little firecracker that she is zoomed up to the front desk and you know was about to unleash upon the desk lady. The desk lady was honestly being kind of rude. She was like, well, and basically told me that she couldn't do anything. And I was like, can't you like call grounds and see if they'll wait for the bags? And she's like, yeah. <laughs> and then she called them and they were like, okay, we'll wait. And I was like, Anyway, and she was like, well, if you don't make it through security 10 minutes before your flight, you won't be able to get on. And an entire college basketball team had just checked in. So I was looking at the line. It was like completely full, like all the way through the, you know, windy line thing. So I was kind of like, okay, haha, -ha, everything's fine. <laughs> Uh, I was really scared. I got through security and turns out everything was fine, but it sucked because I didn't get to like have a long goodbye with my family, which maybe was ultimately for the best because we all couldn't like be all sad about it. I was like, okay, I have to go by. <laughs> and then I got on my plane. But yeah, that was some drama.
The next clips were filmed in the literal airplane bathroom because I was too scared to film in my seat. There is a lot of noise so I am gonna put subtitle sorry in advance. Also why are airplane bathrooms so loud? It's 7 p.m. Korea time, so that means it's 4 a.m. American time. I woke up at 4 a.m. I've been traveling for 48 hours. I mean, wait, what? Okay, <laughs> I haven't been traveling for 48 hours. Since I woke up to start my traveling day, it's been 24 hours. But I'm here. <laughs> it was long, I don't... What was I gonna say? I don't know. I, I'm in Korea right now. I just got to my Airbnb and my friend Diane is getting off work right now and I'm about to go meet her for my first dinner in Korea. I'm really excited. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get sick from the plane. I was wearing a mask for like almost the whole time and then during one of the meals, I took my mask off and like folded it up next to me, but I forgot which side I had my mouth on and it had been like under my leg on the seat. And so I didn't want to put the mask back on because I didn't want to like touch airplane seat to my mouth. But then the guy next to me started sneezing and I was like, oh my God. And I panicked and put my mask back on. So either I got sick from the guy next to me or I got sick from my mask, but the odds are I got sick. <laughs> it just took like almost two hours to get from the airport into Seoul. I'm staying in an Airbnb in Itaewon right now. I'll be here for a week before I start doing like work stuff. So I'm just gonna be chilling. Hanging out. That's all I can think of to update you. Korean traffic? Kind of insane. I thought Italian traffic was bad. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm gonna go. I think Diane's waiting for me, so maybe I'll vlog eating. Maybe this is the end of the vlog. I don't really know. Probably not, though. Bye. You know what? I'm struggling right now, so it's the perfect time to vlog. <laughs> so I've been wandering around for like a long time. Also, it snowed today. Oh, also, I'm in Korea. Relax. I got coffee, this is helping me a lot, um, but now I really want food, but I can't find anywhere. And I, I'm stopped on the corner because there's free Wi-Fi on this corner of the street, and so I don't want to leave. And I really wish I could just GPS my ass to like a food place, but once again, no service. I'm gonna go, I'm really hungry. And also I'm panicking. Breaking news, I got food, finally. I got a croissant thing. I'm about to go get another one because I'm super hungry. I have Wi-Fi, I have heating, and I have food all as well. Hello. <laughs> One day I'll not feel awkward vlogging with my friend Diane. We're about to go meet our new friend Min. Neither of us have met him, but we're about to. And also, I don't even know if this is going in because I thought that it was only going to be a travel vlog, but it might just be my first day vlog. Have you met our friend? And also, this cafe is covered in paraphernalia of this man. Is he a man? He seems to be a boy. <laughs> <laughs> 
We're gonna go get lunch now. Hey guys, I'm Alfie Days. <laughs> okay, I'm back home now. I just um got lunch with my friends, Man and Diane. And I'm realizing that I'm just like vlogging at this point and this whole video is supposed to be about like me moving, not like a daily vlog, which is what this video is becoming at this point. So I think that this is gonna be it. I don't even know what this video is. It's a mess is what it is. Let me know if you even like this like vlog style because I'm so bad at it. And so if you like it, I'm gonna have to get better at it. I, the, the point is I live in Korea now. <laughs> <laughs> it's done. It's over. I'm here and I live here now and I live here now. Thanks for watching. Bye. I think that is real. Guys, that's what they're trading. Trade what? All those videos. We have to do something and we have to do it now. Who's that?